Today, Apple launched their much anticipated operating system, iOS 6, for Apple iPhones, iPads, and the iPod Touch. One feature they've built in is the ability to share your content on Facebook. Today, we're gonna to show you how to turn this option on and three ways that you can share content from your iPad. So first, you wanna to go to your System Preferences panel and select Facebook. Here, you're gonna have a few options. Within the Settings menu, if you record a lot of HD video, you wanna make sure you turn this option on so you get the best quality. Another feature you can do is you can turn on calendar and contacts. What this is gonna do is it's gonna pull this information directly from Facebook. In addition, you can also update all of your contacts on your iOS device so that you can have your Facebook information in your contacts. So once you've logged into your account, now how do we go about sharing this content? Well, there's three ways. One of those ways is from the notifications panel you know have an option that says tap to post. What this does is it gives you the ability to post a random thought directly to your Facebook profile. Here you have a couple of controls. You have the ability to select your location and also some privacy settings. One thing to note, there's no way to post to a Facebook page. This only lets you post to a Facebook profile. So once you've finished, you simply click post and that's it. So what's the second way that you can post to Facebook from your iPad or your iPhone? Well, it's from Safari. All you need to do is launch a website and if you have an article you wanna post, you simply click the arrow next to the URL. What it's gonna do is it's gonna attach a thumbnail and then you can go in and add your own thoughts. So the third way to post to Facebook from your iPad is to go into your photos and to select a photo and post it to Facebook. To do this, you simply go into your photo and click the arrow icon in the top right hand corner. You'll now see the Facebook icon. Select this and Facebook will now let you add a caption as well as a location and change the privacy settings. So that's it guys. That's how to turn on Facebook sharing on your iOS device. If you have any questions on using this or you get stuck, feel free to send me a message on my Facebook page. As always, thanks for watching.